Hello, good morning. You're welcome to Rathmichael Rectory for our midweek musing. Well, this morning, as well as it being musing, it's a little bit of an advertisement for a really, really great cause that's coming up. Either side of you, of me rather, you can see daffodils and some balloons advertising National Daffodil Day, which is taking place this Friday, the 26th of March, nationwide. Many of us know that each year, Daffodil Day is one of those massive, wonderful, collaborative, charitable events across Ireland. When thousands of volunteers take to the streets selling daffodils and indeed these lapel badges of a daffodil in order to raise much needed funds for the Irish Cancer Society. Just a little bit of background on that, the Irish Cancer Society was founded in 1963 by Professor Austin Dara as a result of seeing that 100 people died each year from skin cancer that if they had had information available to them their lives would have been spared. Thankfully in the 50 or 60 years since then cancer care has come on an awful lot not least in part due to the fundraising and advocacy work of the Irish Cancer Society. Today the Irish Cancer Society spend its money on education primarily around cancer. I myself have recently gone onto the website and have learnt quite a bit. I encourage you to do the same. Cancer, as we know, is something that, well, we're told nowadays affects the one in two. It has affected my own family, as I know it has affected many families in this parish. If it hasn't affected your family personally, then you will know somebody who has been affected by cancer. I mentioned at the start what happens on Daffodil Day usually. Thousands of volunteers take to the streets to raise money. But also, there are information events nationwide and of course the famous Daffodil Day coffee morning. And here in Rathmichael Parish, and indeed the wider Shankill community, in normal times, our dearly loved parishioner Marion Conboy has organised a truly successful coffee morning for Daffodil Day that has become part of the annual calendar in the Shankill area. Last year, Daffodil Day essentially got cancelled due to lockdown coming this year. We're more prepared and although we can't meet in person for our coffee morning, I have my cup of coffee here and I encourage you to take time, perhaps at coffee time on Friday morning, 11 o'clock, where we can all pause, have that spiritually distant cup of coffee and reflect on how cancer has impacted our lives and what we can do in our own way to help the Irish Cancer Society. There's a very practical way that you can help. Marion is holding her fundraiser this year, although it's not going to be a physical fundraiser. Daffodils are not going to be sold. Lapel badges are not going to be sold or worn that much, but you can still donate. Right now on your screens, the information for donating to the Rathmichael Parish bank account is coming up. You can also give donations to Marion in person or to Lily Byrne, our honorary treasurer, or indeed to Anne Thompson, the parish administrator. Those details, which you've just seen, will also come up at the end of this video and will remain in situ for a few seconds for you to get them. And you can, of course, go back onto this video to get them again. I hope that as you sit at 11 o'clock or thereabouts on Friday morning and have that cup of coffee and think about the impact that cancer has had on your life, the lives of friends, family, that you would consider making a generous donation this year. We're in tough times, but I know that the spirit of generosity is still there. I would encourage you to donate generously to the fundraiser. It would be wonderful, as in past years, if Marion could, at the end of it all, send a generous and sizable cheque to the Irish Cancer Society. We know they spend it well, they spend it wisely, and we never know when any of us 
is going to need the help of a cancer charity that will also benefit from the Irish Cancer Society. I might finish by thanking Marion and indeed all of the volunteers throughout the parish who have successfully done that coffee morning throughout the years. I look forward to hopefully being able to join with you all this time next year for an in-person coffee morning and what a celebration that will be. But in the meantime, I would ask also for your prayers for those parishioners and those families in the parish who are currently experiencing cancer and what that brings and also for those families who have recently and in other times been bereaved as a result of cancer. Our thoughts and our prayers are with them today and on this Daffodil Day coming on Friday. Let's join together 11 o'clock on Friday morning, have a cup of coffee, sit down, perhaps even watch this video again and get the details for giving to the Irish Cancer Society Daffodil Day. May God bless you all. Take care.